What is going on guys, today I'm going to teach you how to UV map in Blender. This is going to be mainly for people who already know how to UV map, but it's just going to quickly show them the tools and the shortcuts to doing it in Blender. So first thing you need to do, select your asset, push Ctrl A and click all transforms. This will basically freeze it and make it so when you're UV mapping it, your UVs should be the same dimensions as your 3D port asset. Next, press tab. And we're going to select where we want the seams to be. The seams is where it's going to unwrap and cut in the UV sheet. So I'm going to do here, here. To select a seam or to select a edge loop, shall I say, push Alt and left click and it will select the entire edge loop. And if you hold Shift with that, it will add it on top, like any sort of selection tool. So that's what I'm going to use for my seam. Press F3, right, mark seam, or you can press Control E and do mark seam there. After that, you can select it, press U. So selecting everything is A, and then after selecting it all, press U and click unwrap. Then up here, go into UV editing, and you see we've got that unwrapped. You don't necessarily need to do that first, you could always come into your UV now and then do it again. And I'll unwrap for you. If you've got multiple assets, let's say we were to combine them now and they're already being unwrapped, what you've got to do is press F3, right, pack island, like this. If some of your assets are of obviously different scale, like this, you should first press F3 and go average island scale, which will get you to the right sizes and then pack your islands. Last one I want to show is up here at the top left, which is UV sync selection. By default, this is turned off. You would turn it, so when I go to select UVs, you won't see anything coming up here. If I turn it on, when I select UVs, it will show you what I'm selecting over here. This could be useful if you've got some issues in your UVs and you're trying to find what part of the mesh is causing that issue. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll catch you next time.